Hey guys! So it has been a bit, like it has, it's been a while <laughs> since I filmed a video in general. Luckily all good crazy things, my life's changing. I'm in my mid-twenties. I can say I'm finally in my mid-twenties, wow. I feel really old saying that, but that is when life changes. I moved to my first home, I've renovated my first home, so I've been super distracted with life and all good things, life and family so the most important things. Please excuse me if I seem a little bit scatterbrained. Like I said, I have not filmed in a while. So today I'm going to be filming a Abercrombie try on haul. And I actually threw in a few things. This top, funny enough, is not from Abercrombie, it's from Macy's. But I bought three items from Macy's that I really wanna show you. They are so cute, including this top. And I got it on like a super deal. Um, I was looking around for summer clothes and I was like, where can I shop? Like I'm kind of out of place that I feel like I used to have all these stores that I was shopping at and, and then I got a little bit older and I'm like some of the things I used to wear in college and kind of earlier in my 20s I feel like they are quite adultish for me if that makes sense so my sister and I were talking about this she's 27 I'm 24 and we've really been struggling to find things that are our age we're like we need stores that are like they were made for mid to late 20s early 30s we can't find anything like in that age range because you know like you want to look cute and young still but you don't want it to maybe expose as much skin as you used to want to which there's nothing wrong with that hey if you want to do that that's that's totally great it's up to you but just kind of in my day-to-day -day life I'm like you know I'm not really going out to bars anymore I'm not really doing that so I need to find something that's more modest but still cute and after that long rant uh, let's just get right into this video. I want to show you I finally did find some super cute things from Abercrombie. So let's get right into this video. Alright guys. And I did want to share with you guys, this is one of the Macy's Backstage shirts is what it's called. So it's up in Macy's section, upstairs at least in our mall, that is all discount items. So the shirt was originally 60 bucks, and I got it for $19.99. It's a size medium, so it fits pretty loose, which I really like that, and it has a really nice waist. But it is Mason Jewels brand, so go look for it. I literally can't recommend this top enough. I, I'm in love with it, and I don't normally find things at Macy's that I'm in love with. Alright guys, so this is another shirt from Macy's Backstage. It has a lot of frills as you can see. It's this really cute bubblegum pink color. Um, I absolutely love it. I'm obsessed with smocked shirts because I feel like they are so flattering on really anyone's figure. Especially the ones that just come in at the waist. This one's tight top to bottom, but I still think it's really flattering. Um, and it has a little, a little ruffle detail at the bottom of this shirt. And the sleeves are really neat because they're also smocked. They're smocked right here and then they're loose and puffy and really light cottony material and the rest of the shirt so this is as I said again from Macy's backstage the cool thing about this is you can wear it up or down like I would probably wear it up more than anything ignore my bra strap um it's kind of a little bit hard to like you have to pull the sleeves up higher like this if you're gonna wear it up I just am not like a huge strapless bra girl <laughs> but if you are then definitely or better yet if you don't even have to wear a bra I would definitely wear it down on the shoulders it's super cute that way too but yeah I really liked this one as well this one was $24 the brand is HFVE or something um some brand I've never heard of but again it was just at Macy's in their Macy's backstage section so these shirts I'm unsure I'll have to check online and see if they have like a backstage section or if it's only an in-store thing but I did find this in store same with the blue top and then I have one more item it's this little purse I am dead okay so is this not the cutest little purse ever it looks really high-end, I think. Um, obviously, this is removable. This doesn't have to be on here. I just kind of like that it was cute, summery, and springy. Um, and the brand is Nanette Lepore. I probably said that totally wrong. I've never heard of the brand before, so it may or may not be... I'm sure it's not anything crazy, but I thought it looked almost like a Kate Spade purse. 
it fits perfectly over my shoulder. Love the color. I don't have anything purple. So I was like, oh my gosh. I actually got this for a wedding that I went to. Um, I'm really in love with it. Inside's awesome. All sorts of pockets. One here, one on this side. That's a zipper pocket. It also came with this cute little money pouch that was attached to the front. Um, I obviously took it out, but you can put, you know, coins, whatever, anything in here. Really, it's super cute and it matches. So I stuck it inside here and I love all the zippers. And again, the size, like the size is perfect. So yay me. Oh, and side note, this purse was only like 30 bucks. And that's why I bought it. Cause I was like, that looks so nice. It's such a nice leather. It's so high end looking, but it was like 30 bucks. And I think it was originally like 60 or 70. So it wasn't like an outrageously crazy expensive purse. I love it. So yeah, huge fan. All right, guys, this is my first Abercrombie shirt. The most comfortable shirt I've probably ever worn. It's very like, like a wrap dress, but a shirt style. Also smocked, as you can see, a theme's going on here. Super summery, flowy, puffy sleeves. They actually aren't tight, so they're super comfy at the bottom because they're not like a tight band. They're just really loose and comfy, and I really like this one because, again, super summery. I feel like you could go pick some strawberries in this. Maybe hang out at a birthday party. You can go to anywhere in this. Like, I'm trying to find things that I can maybe possibly wear to church with obviously not jean shorts and then also go over to my mom's and then maybe go out to a restaurant at the end of the day. Versatile wear. <laughs> so I absolutely love this one and it is like a, it's kind of like a mauve pink kind of color. It's also super flattering. I really like it. And I really like how one you can wear a bra with it, don't have to worry. And it's super, super comfy. Three, two, one. Arguing again, arguing about something so simple. Make it clear, tell me why. Alright guys, so this top is also from Abercrombie. Super cute, kind of more of a baby doll style. It's got some cool puffy sleeves here. You can see, see they kind of go up, which I like. They're really like, they're like butterfly sleeves. They're flowy and really cute. I am personally not wearing a bra with this and I feel like everything like looks okay. It's not padded, but the ruffle kind of makes it okay to not wear a bra and not have to worry about it. Because of that, super, super comfortable. It's kind of shorter, if you can tell. It's not a crop top, but like it covers my button of my shorts, but I really like this one. I was unsure about this style on me personally, but I really do like it. It's kind of a good cute shape because it kind of gives you this like cinch in right here. Love the color blue. Blue is my favorite color in case anyone knows or cares. Probably not, that's okay. But I love blue, it's my favorite. I've been trying to add more pinks as you can tell, but I just always go back to blue. So I really love this color. All right, guys, so you can see that I actually changed shorts. These are a darker pair of Abercrombie shorts. I will show y'all the shorts at the end. I love these jean shorts and I'm gonna have to brag about them. But as far as this top, it is this really cute, first of all, this is the length of it. I'm tucking it in a little bit with these shorts to look better. So it's not really a crop, but you would probably have to wear a high-waisted shorts or pants with it, I think, to not show your belly. And it is this really neat, like, rust reddish brown it's, it looks more orange right now in the video but in real life it's kind of more of like a brownie orange which isn't a color but you know what I'm trying to say yeah and so I actually got this shirt for a country concert I'm going to here soon um Dwight Yoakam concert so shout out to Dwight Yoakam my dad is a huge fan so he's dragging us all along on July 1st to go see him so I'm really excited I'm gonna get some boots on probably wear this outfit maybe try to find a cowgirl hat unsure about that but the sleeves are super cute They're they're cinched here. It's still really comfy even though they're cinched. And you can make them, Kaylin, get out of here. You can make them longer like this or have them more puffed up like this, which is really cute. Both are cute. As you can see, the top is a little bit kind of ruffled right here. It's not really ruffled. What is this called? Pleated, I guess, as you can see. And then it goes into like kind of a corset type top, has two seams right here. And it's really cute. I'm wearing this without a bra, but you can wear a bra with it easily because it has, I, I don't think you might have some issues right here kind of showing just depends if you have a strapless bra you can wear that but i do really like this top all of the tops that i'm going to show you except for one which is the last top i will show you are in a size small <laughs> i'm going to be like some of the models online and be like i'm abby i am 5'3 and i am wearing a size small and it fits true to size so <laughs> this is a little bit of a tighter shirt as you can tell because again it's smocked in the back so what's nice about the smocking i think is that like it's gonna fit whatever size because it's stretchy. 
so you can make it fit and it looks really good. It's tight in all spots, if that makes sense. Instead of being like super loose in one area versus the other, it's gonna fit everywhere because it's smocked. I feel like I'm just kind of being redundant about this whole smock thing. I think every single shirt that I got is smocked except the one, the last one I'm gonna show you. So I actually got the shirt in white as well, so let me show you that really fast. Alright guys, so here's this shirt in white. Makes you look super tan, which I do like that. And I actually got this in two colors because I knew I would love it because the puppy sleeves. Luckily, it fits really well. But it's one of those tops, especially in white, that's gonna match every like printed or a crazy skirt bottom that you have or crazy shorts. I needed like a versatile top that would match all of the patterned things that I own, if that makes sense. Because I actually have a really cute pink lily haul that I will be doing here soon of all these really cute skirts and bottoms that I ordered. So I'm really excited to show you all that. But I basically got the shirt to match all that stuff, so. I am gonna show you these shorts. They're super, super comfortable. These are the Abercrombie Dad Shorts is what they're called. So they're loose right here, which I wanted that. I was sick of having them super tight or super short. So they're a little bit like longer. Like here's my length of my shortness. Wow, I look really short in the camera right now. I mean, I'm 5'3", so I'm pretty short. My legs are short. My torso's short, but I feel like they're good. They're high-waisted, which I wanted that. You can see the, the top is a little bit, um, it's still a little looser. One was a little bit bigger, and then one was a little bit smaller size because they only had a smaller size of one. So if this was a little bit looser, bigger size, let me figure that out for you. The one thing about these shorts is, without exposing too much, they button like this instead of zipping. So that's interesting. Um, it's not that bad, it's just kind of more annoying when you, you know, you have to go to the bathroom, but it's kind of cool and like old school at the same time. So these are the dark wash ones and these are the lighter wash ones. So these are in the smaller size. These are a size 26 or two and the other ones were a size four or 27, I believe. So this is probably more true to my size. It's tight, fits really well in my waist, fits everywhere really well. I just like to have kind of a looser pair. Also on certain days, I just want to be more comfortable. The other ones are obviously a little more comfortable, but that being said, these are still the comfiest shorts, both pairs that I've ever owned of jean shorts. We all know jean shorts can ride up and kind of be a nightmare. So these are actually really comfy and I really like how they are like this in the back mostly. So I really love that. They fit super well and I'm glad I finally found some appropriate length for my age. Now I feel in kind of looser shorts. All right, guys, so this is the final shirt. Um, it's very oversized. As you can see, it's pretty long. I wanted a nice, flowy, long, comfy shirt, and that's definitely what I got. I got this in a size medium, but it's already oversized, so I probably could have gone with a small. I would probably recommend getting true to size because it already said oversized on the website. I just kind of ignored it. Um, it's this really super soft material. I don't even know what material this is. It's like a light, airy, super soft to the touch material. It looks a little bit more yellow on the camera. It's a little bit more lime green in person. And let me show you how I'm gonna wear it. Okay, so I'm going to start kind of wearing it like so, maybe tying it in more of a, you know, to kind of get this vibe going on. Super comfy, easy to wear, put on over a swimsuit. Um, it's just one of those shirts that probably would cover your bum too, which yeah, I just love it. I love how comfy it is and I want something loose and comfy for days when you don't always want to wear something tight, you know? Alright guys, and last but not least, I got a little dress. I love this dress. It feels like a little princess dress. Um, it's a really bright yellow. I don't have anything yellow like this. It's got kind of a floral pattern on it. And it has this really cute corset, again, smocked top right here. You can kind of see the line there. I have it up on my shoulders right now like this. I'll show you how short it is when it's like this. So it gets a lot shorter when it's up on my shoulders, but I think it's meant to be worn kind of this way. So it makes it a little bit longer. I'm not wearing a bra with this. You could definitely wear a strapless bra or probably a normal bra if it was up on your um, shoulders like that. But like I said, it makes it a lot shorter. So I feel like this really was meant to be worn kind of down like this. Um, I just think it's really beautiful, really pretty, a good twirling dress. As you can see, it's a really good twirling dress. So yeah, I just really liked it. I wanted a cool, summery, comfy, lightweight dress that's a little bit more casual, doesn't have to be super fancy. That's definitely what I got. It's a very thin material, just something to keep in mind. Like the top is lined, I think, but the bottom, like this skirt, definitely gonna wanna wear some nude underwear with this because it's pretty light. Um, yeah, and this is also a size small. Also, just saying, this combo, 
It's pretty cute. I mean, I know purple and yellow. Like, is that a thing? All right, guys, that is everything. So yeah, um, that was all of the things that I got from Backstage Macy's or Macy's Backstage and Abercrombie. I really, really loved this stuff for summer. I'm in love with a lot of things that I got. So um, I really hope this helped you if you're also in that in-between age where you're like, you know, I'm, I'm not gonna dress like I'm maybe 21 or like that anymore, but you don't necessarily wanna dress like an, an adult adult. You're, you don't have kids yet. You're kind of that in-between. That's that's where I'm at right now. I don't, I don't know how to dress for my age. So I'm kind of figuring it out because it's a very transitional time in my life, as I'm sure it is for a lot of people's lives. Like, you know, you're mid to late 20s, early 30s. It's that time when everything's kind of changing. You're changing, your body's changing. So I've definitely noticed a lot of that I just I hope this helped out. Whenever I ordered these things from Abercrombie, they were on sale. I do want to say, I feel like they're always on sale, which I love that about Abercrombie. Um, so definitely take advantage of that. And if you go to the website one day and things aren't on sale, just wait like a couple days or a week. Guarantee there will be a sale. So you never have to pay full price for anything at Abercrombie, which I love. It's affordable, even though it's become a little bit more um, expensive all in all. I think it's still very affordable because it has sales. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked this video, please hit that like button below and subscribe to my channel. I will see you all next week or whenever I pop back in. <sighs> all right. Bye guys. Oh, this is a video. <sighs> oh my gosh. I literally forgot how to be a YouTuber. Yeah. Am I a YouTuber if I only post every couple months? Yeah. Am I still a YouTuber? You're still a tuber. <laughs>